You know, I was asked at the Source Summit, the very first one at the end of 2013, December of 2013, I was asked the question, what could I do as an elected official or what would I propose that the government do to help the people of Eastern Kentucky as it relates to job creation and other things? Mm -hmm. And what I said then is the same thing I say now, but given the fact that as a state we're broke and, and the federal government is broke, we're borrowing money hand over fist, the better question we need to ask is what can the government stop doing to the people of Eastern Kentucky? We've got to stop suffocating job creation. We overregulate things to death. It starts with the EPA. That's at a federal level. But as a governor, I have made very clear that not only will I not submit a plan to comply with CO2 cuts, which they're asking us to do volitionally, I will not do this as governor. I will also not comply with anything that we are not legally bound to comply with at the state level. We've got to start looking out for the best interests of Kentuckians. This has got to be the focus not only of a governor, but frankly, of every elected official in this state. I am a guy who does, I know how to create jobs. I've done this. I have guys, I have folks that work for me, men and women who don't even have a GED, others who have PhDs. I've hired people all over the spectrum, but I understand what it takes to create a job. I understand how increasingly difficult it is for job creators in the state of Kentucky to do it here and how tempting it is to go to places like Tennessee or Indiana mm -hmm. to start those companies.